Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If your dream is to become a data scientist or a data analyst, then cracking the SQL interview is a very important stage for attaining your dream. Myself, I'm Malu Prasad. I'm a mentor for data science and analytics. I can help you overcome this obstacle by explaining all the various questions asked in the top companies which are available at the LeetCode platform. All my code solutions for the questions available in LeetCode platform are there in my GitHub repository. The link for that is available in the chat description below. In addition to that, I have segregated the channel into five playlists, namely easy, medium and hard depending upon the difficulty of the questions, premium level subscription questions as premium playlist questions and I have combined all the questions into one single playlist as all SQL questions. Now let's see the question which we are trying to solve it today. It is type medium, question number 0585, investments in 2016. Let's see the question. It is already asked in Twitter. Okay. It is consisting of a table of insurance which is having PID column. Okay. Okay. It is just a serial number where 2AV15 is the what you call this one. Yeah, the investments which are done in 2015. TAV 2016 is the investment which are done in 2016. Lat and longitude are location of that place. Now, what they're asking. Write an SQL query to report the sum of total investments in 2016 for all POSI holders who have the same 2015 value as one or more POSI holders. Okay, first condition and are not located from the same cities like other POSI holders. Latitude, longitude, pair must be unique. Okay, round the TIV to two digits. Okay, got it. Let's see this one. If you see here, there are how many policy holders? One minute. There are four policy holders. For example, first guy is there. He is from location 1010. Okay. Second guy is there. He is location from he is from location 2020. Third guy is there. He is from location 2020. Fourth guy is there. Location from 2040. If you see, only first guy and the fourth guy are the unique. Their first condition is what? Lat and lawn should be unique if you see here this is repeating only one time this is repeating only time. this is repeating two times this is repeating two times okay let's see for the 2015 also and they said the investment in 2015 should be more than once repeated if you see 10 10 10 10 is repeated how many times three times 20 is repeated how many times one time 10 is repeated three times three times okay if you see here three things are satisfied the condition which are satisfied in both the condition is what? If you see here, it is not satisfied. So only in first row and the fourth row, it is satisfying. Wherever it is matching, they are asking the sum of TAV 16. 5 plus 40. 45 is the answer. So simply what we need to do, we will uh, calculate the count of lat and lawn and let's do inner join of that. Then we can get this one. And similarly, we can group by TAV to 15 and we can get the count of that. And if you Combine them again, you will get 3131. Okay. After that, we can filter for where latitude and longitude this column is equal to 1 and this column is greater than 1. Okay, let's see the question. From insurance table group by lat, comma lawn select lat comma Long comma count as let's say uh, location count. Here you can see ten ten is repeated once, twenty twenty is repeated twice, forty twenty is repeated once. Okay, let's call it as CTE one. Now let's count for TAV15 also. Select from 
insurance group by TIV 2015 select TIV 2015 count of as let's say 2015 count or TIV T15 count Okay, what is the mistake I've done here? TIV 2015 insurance table is this because of this one? Okay, I've written select two times. Okay, here you can see this 10 is repeated three times, this 20 is repeated one time. Let's call it CT2. And let's join all the table. Now from insurance table A and now join first of all CT table as B. What is the common column here? Latin lawn. Here common column is Latin lawn on A dot a dot lat equal to b dot lat and b dot lon sorry a dot lon equal to b dot lon select all now you can see here 10 10 is repeated once so once 20 20 is repeated twice so twice 2020 is repeated twice, so twice. 4020 is repeated once, so once. Now, what we need to count for 2015 also we want, so let inner join that also. Inner join CTE2 as C on what is the common column in both the tables? Um, C dot TIV 2015 equal to A dot 2015. Okay, now if you see 10 is repeated 3 times, 20 is repeated 1 time, 10 is repeated 3 times, 10 is repeated 3 times. Now what we want, lat and lon should be unique. So lat and lon count should be 1. Only wherever it is 1, I will take it. Where yellow count equal to 1. And TIV 2014 should be there more than once so t count should be greater than one okay let's take that one let's run it okay now only two rows are matching right now what they said wherever this condition is matching they want the sum of tiv 2016 sum of 16 as TIV 16. Let's run it. Let's submit it. Okay, let me see. Okay, they want, I think, round off. Yeah, let's round off to two digits. Let's submit it. Okay, our solution has been accepted by the platform. Thanks for watching my video. If you want more detailed explanations like this and uh, want to prepare for interviews for SQL round, just subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends and colleagues who are preparing for data analyst, data scientist or business analyst interview for the SQL round. It will be greatly helping them and you also. Thanks for watching once again. Keep practicing, keep hustling, one day you will be able to crack any SQL round.